so and the reason why we haven't been recording much or the reason why we have been um comparatively less active for the past online for the past week. week more than a week more than a week mm. yeah yeah <clears throat> So, yeah. So that's what we're going to talk about. Um, in the next. Okay. So, I am, um, we had, uh, several tragedies in our family uh, losses uh very sudden because it was just last week uh actually we had young uh tabletop gaming event and we talked about it and then just a few days after non i we received word that my brother passed away. Uh, uh, totally unexpected. Um, he 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 had a stroke, and um, he didn't make it to the hospital. So that was just last week, Wednesday. But uh, yeah, and then. Mm, we had to go through the scheduled activities on top of whatever needed to be done. And thankfully, we had our friends, our family there with us, helping us along the way. And his company was very supportive. Uh, from that moment or from that morning, ayun, uh, they've been in touch with my niece and my nephew. And um, it, it's, it's highly appreciated because um, the people who they need all the support that they can get. And we... We hoped we were able to support as much as we could. Uh, from Paranaque to Bulacan and then back and then uh, communicating it to the rest of the family. Uh, um, yung family naman on their mother's side. Kasi yung brother ko yung father nila. Uh, your mom nila also passed away like two years ago so we can only imagine how painful it is for the kids uh yeah so we we tried to be there for them and we are uh we are still uh adjusting like, like my brother was the eldest of us and i am the youngest so uh, there is a lot of adjustment that's going to happen. Uh, pero ang importante is that yung kids niya are safe and secured and supported. So, yun naman yung uh, importante for us. So, the reason why we haven't been online much is because of that. And in it's just difficult to to get online like before emotionally we're still strained because uh just a few days ago yung uncle naman ni edwin also passed so uh, it's a little bit, uh, stroke, stroke so 
we wanted to go and visit. Uh, medyo bigla, may kasi yung nangyari. Uh, pagka stroke, uh, we were just waiting. Ano pong balita, pero we were kind of expecting it already. Because, kung tumawag yung mom ko sa akin, sabi niya nung mom ko, it's, it's really bad. Uh, we don't know it. He's gonna survive it, you know, sabi naman to. So, after that, less than an hour from that call, uh, tumawag na yung mom ko, and sabi ng mom ko, banana, he passed away. So, this is not even counting na I had another uncle who just passed away. A month um, ago? Wala pa. Week so, week lang. A week lang. A week lang. Uh, so one week lang ang difference nila kapatid sila so si yon yung uncle ko last week he's the third he's the third of the family habang itong recent she yung youngest she yung sixth in the family so masakit lalo na siguro sa sa family namin kasi well he was the first sa magkakapatid na yung ano yung so na uh, yung last ano last week he was the first tapos syempre yeah to pass away tapos biglang syempre they were still adjusting so biglang hearing so, na sumunod just a week later ito ang uncle ko na isa Nakapag-visit pa kami dun sa isang uncle ko sa last week. Um, pero yung sa, kap- sa brother-in-law ko, sa, sa kapatid niya, pati sa uncle ko recently, we just, we really wanted to be, we really wanted to be there sa funeral and sa wake. Uh, <clears throat> sa inurnment. Yeah. Or sa, uh-huh. sa cremation. Yeah. Pero, it, it was just not possible, even though we really, really tried to, it was... We had prior commitments yeah. that we had to power forward. Like, we, we really had to go you know, autopilot. <laughs> yeah. Um... Just this past weekend was supposed to be. Uh, I planned it with my brother. We had the whole weekend planned, and with what happened, you know, na nangyari, um, I had to go through with the plan without, without him. So we just thank the our friends, friends and, family. and family who helped us through and understood why we cannot be physically there but all throughout those days nasa isip namin yun. Uh, our thoughts are with them our prayers are with them. So, uh, as soon as I got home from that event, I, well, I haven't been feeling well. And right now, I'm still recovering. But you see, Edwin is kind of, we're both kind of sick. <laughs> yeah. Mm, pero we know naman na neither of them want us to reach a point that we are so sad we are sick <laughs> we're working on it so kuya ninong andy we're taking things by the day so so we'll take things by the day just keep on moving forward. Yeah. 
it's just that we have to accept that the plans that we have made before will just be plans with them but we have to push forward with them in spirit so yeah so hopefully in in the following videos that will be uploaded uh we'll i know we'll try to get more often in in uploading but it's it's of course going to mm, not be the same agad agad <laughs> yeah so uh, it, it's part of the healing healing yeah. grieving it will be part of the grieving process i say we also have to be to be able to look forward and uh, to push forward because uh, we're still here yes we're still here and it's something that they would want for us din man. and it's something that they want us to continue so <laughs> thank you sa mga nagme-message sa amin na support and uh, praying for strength the family needs it uh, the family always needs prayers of strength and uh, mm, knowing na um, we're not alone we're not we're not on our own that's that's a big thing of course we have each other and sometimes pareho kaming malungkot <laughs> so kailangan din namin ng ibang magsasabi sa amin for, yan, for me it was Kasi it was only about a year ago, more than a year ago, when I lost another brother. The first one to pass among us. And then, just last week, yung isa ko pang kapatid. Uh, whenever we are sad about, about uh, that loss, my brother would would be there to answer any message or any question that i had and now yeah i have to accept that uh i won't see their likes anymore i won't see their messages anymore and it's gonna be the same for us who was left here uh, our mom si nanay, my sister and my brother tatlo na lang kami and then our nephews and nieces and for edwin and so thank you to Jojo and Nino and Dino. Yeah. Yeah, see si Nino and Dino eh, parang inspiration ko for art. No, no. Say, siya yung sansana, siya yung sa animation. Siya yung trabaho sa animation. Yeah. Nalala ko nun yun, no? Na, when they were working on snorks if you remember that animation parang mm -hmm. smurfs pero sa, il sa ilalim sila ng tubig ay nasa taas yung yung mm -hmm. na nasa taas yung parang ilong nila or something ah, yeah. yeah they were working on that tapos pinapakita sa akin lumang style ng animation yung cell shading 
you know, I, I really wanted to visit San Pablo before all of this happened. Gusto ko sana bumalik yung makapag-bisibisita doon. Salamat na lang na kahit paano we were able to visit him dito Jojo. Uh, during, ano, sa kanyang funeral. <clears throat> Pero yung kay Nino Andy, I we really wanted to go. Pero yun, alanganin yung ano, alanganin yung hindi kami napayagan sa work. Tapos, Dependent uh, kasi talaga tayo na. So, hindi ako napayagan sa work. Tapos, the distance papunta sa Infanta Quezon is five or five more hours. hours a day. Uh, ano? Five to six or more. Meron pa nga mga instances na baka 11 Depending hours Depending on pa. traffic. Depending on traffic and the bus line na masasakyan. So, uh, iikot kasi ng Laguna Lake. Eh. That's five so, to six hours going pa lang. Going pa lang yan. No? So, another five to six hours to ano, getting back. Getting back. So, it was really difficult to schedule something to visit. Tapos, medyo mabilis yung pag-ibing. Parang nalaman, uh, nalaman ko lang yung burial on Tuesday. Kasi doon lang nila inayos. Tapos Wednesday na nila ililibing. So, parang, it, uh, hindi, kahit anong gawin ko, hindi ako mapayagan ng trabaho. to get off. Uh, sabi kasi sa akin, at least two or three days ahead. Pero, ganun pa rin. Ah, mahirap. Ang ano, mahirap. Yung ganito. Kahit nga to sa San Pablo eh. Kaya from San Pablo, it takes to five hours biyahe. San Pablo na yun. And that's closer, I think. It's closer. And pero yun nga, I, I was devastated because I was really hoping I could be there to represent the family. Pero yeah, it was just not enough. It was not possible with a rushed schedule. And I, I, was, you know, I, was, I was saddened by that. We're, we're sharing this. Uh... In, in the video and in in Edwin's channel because uh, if uh, if any of you know the channel is actually Edwin's way of connecting yeah and he has all of you as his friends That in many ways, you watching helps him through this. That knowing you guys are there watching and commenting makes him feel that he's doing something right. <laughs> And it's something that we both look forward to, that uh, somehow there is something we can still do the next day. There is something that we can still share the next day. So, uh, we, uh, we just appreciate Kahit. Just you being here and watching. And that means a lot. So thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. It really means a lot. Okay. Hmm? Okay. Bye.